So one of the big surprises at the Polestar Day was our first look at the undisguised Polestar 5. We've obviously seen the engineering prototype. In fact, that's one just over there with a camo and it's been at the Goodwood Festival of Speed, but this is the first time we're seeing it undisguised. Now this is still a design model, so there's no interior that I can show you, but the interior is, or sorry, the exterior is what you're gonna see when the Polestar 5 comes out. First thing you'll notice about this is the side profile looks superb. Very, very long, quite elegant. Uh, you can see how the window extends just a little bit more, this window frame design, quite like that. Again, like the Polestar 4, which is just up there, there is no rear window in the Polestar 5. So it does without a rear window. Instead, you have a camera system just in there. Bit of a good view of it. And you have a full glass roof as well. And that glass roof does come quite the way back when you see it right above, right behind the rear headrests. Uh, one of the other things about the back as well is just how these kind of headlights are pronounced, how they stick out from the rear. You've really got a pronounced shoulder line there, the haunches of the car. But that's what you get from the rear view. That's what people will see when you're driving the Polestar 5 in traffic. Looks very, very distinctive, very purposeful looking. But yeah, that's uh, that's what the rear is like. But again, you've got flush door handles, same as what we have on the other Polestar models. Conventional door mirrors as well, but you do also have an extended camera base system here on the car. This is also one of the first cars that's going to use the store dot technology. Uh, which is what the guys here are for. And this is targeting very interesting, really, really rapid charging speeds. Talking about adding 160 kilometers of range in five minutes. So that is a big thing that the Polestar 5 is obviously gonna be targeting. The other thing about the Polestar 5 is that this is the first Polestar model that is built using their own bespoke platform architecture. So this is one that they've designed. It's been um, developed in the UK through their engineering division there. And unlike the other models that use and share the same platforms as some other products like Volvo cars, the Polestar 5 will be the first one that will have its own dedicated bonded aluminium uh, platform or a chassis. So that's gonna be quite an interesting thing to how that drives a big, big deal about this car is how it is going to handle and how it's going to perform so we'll have to wait and see uh, obviously this is going to be a car that comes in 2025 so we have a little bit longer to wait but that's our first look at the Polestar 5 in the flesh what do you think let us know get involved in the comments tell us what you think and uh, we'd love to hear what your opinions are on it